the governor had a very, very tough budget to present. You know, he's faced with almost a $4 billion shortfall. So um, just to start out, uh, we haven't experienced anything like this in the last 20 years. He's kind of made some difficult choices. One of the first things that I noticed about the budget, for the last, last eight years, it's been smoke and mirrors, where the, where the uh, governor Rendell would offline spend, would take something out of the budget and put it somewhere else, and say, well, I didn't grow the budget as much. Uh, what he's shown you, the governor is not going to do the smoke and mirrors thing. Everything is in the budget. He's moving even the tobacco fund money into the budget so that people can see it online. People back home can go on a computer and access the website and know exactly where their money is being spent. I applaud him for that. My biggest issue is the school funding. I, I, I'm going to look very closely at it, the effect it's going to have on our schools. It is a major issue back home. We have a, we have a tremendous amount of folks hurting and we might not be able to afford the cuts that are being presented. So I'm already working with his office to see that corrected. Otherwise, I, I think he's put a good budget forward, and I, I will enjoy working with him in the next um, few months to, to, to ratify his budget.